going on, guys? Hope everyone's doing absolutely fantastic. It's Monday night at around 9.15 p.m. We got Kev here. Repping. Repping Shane's Shane. shirt. So long story short, guys, this has been a long time coming. This girl that we're cutting a clutch today. This girl we cut the clutch with today, I've had since June of 2020. This is our first clutch ever. So I'll show her off to you. Uh, she's a, a yellow belly and she double head clown pie. She's deep in shed right now, obviously. She's back on food. She's eating really, really well. Um, but I've had her for, I guess, almost three and a half years at this point, which kind of shows you the ups and the downs when it comes to breeding ball pythons, right? Like we had that, that pastel spot nose girl that we hatched out in 2021. We had her in eggs in 2022, right? Then conversely, I bought this girl in 2020 and I just got her on eggs now in well, the end of 2023 kind of just happens that way. She's been of size for a long time. She reabsorbed one season on me, and the next season she didn't want to lock. So kind of is what it is. That's the nature of the beast. So you will hear people say you can get eggs out of a female in 18 months, which is true because we did that. We hashed that female out. But in the long run, in actuality, this could happen too. So I'm not going to lie to you. Obviously, when I sell animals that are het something, I tell you exactly what it is. Some breeders aren't that way. And I'm not going to say the breeder I got this from isn't that way, but I have heard some horror stories. So with that being said, before we cut, I'm going to show you guys the egg. So this is the girl I bought. That's the female I just showed you, okay? This is the date right here, June um, 9th, 2020. Uh, right after COVID, I can tell you I was at the 6-7 precinct still, and this is what I, I actually purchased her for 900 or 800 bucks, I believe, uh, plus shipping, okay? And this is the guy I got her from, all right, just so we can see. All right, this is the breeder right here that sold me this female, all right, guys? Right there, all right? Here we go, Carlson Phelps, okay? But this is the actual ad of the female right here. And she, yellow belly, double head, clown pie, sold, female. She is definitely a female. She's definitely yellow belly, she's definitely <laughs> and she, all right? And what we bred her to is an actual clown pie, all right? So it's a clown pie, do a double head. He's actually gonna be leaving soon. Uh, here he is right here, he's sold. And he will be on his way. Stud. Look at him. He's a big old breeder. All right. Fresh shed. Really gorgeous looking male. Love it. Love it. Love it. So he, he'll be actually leaving the facility. Probably like this week. Next week. I think this week is supposed to be like in the yeah. 20s. Right? It's going to be cold. The next week will be like in the 40s. So without further ado, guys, we're going to cut the clutch. Let's go. I didn't show that ad for any, any particular reason. Just, just to be honest. Okay? So we're going to see what happens. I mean, obviously, yes, guys. The odds gods do play a role at times, right? With that being said, a double visual through double head, we should see some pie. So she should, should see some clowns, and we should see some clown pie. If we don't see either, we're going to have to shoot him a text. I was going to shoot a text on my phone, but Ken's using my phone. But I will definitely reach out to him. And we'll figure it out from there. But we're not going to say anything yet. We're going to cut first. It is day 56, and as per usual, with our World Banks incubator, I still do want to do uh, a review of the Wilbanks Incubator I used all for this season. Uh, guys, hands down, love it to death. Um, day 56, uh, I keep on at 89 degrees there. Day 56, we've been getting our pips uh, almost religiously, right, Kevin? Yeah, yeah. Right around no there. doubt. Yeah. So, we, Diesel. so that one did pip. I already saw the head, guys. It wasn't a clown, I'm not going to lie to you. So I'll cut that one first. We'll take a look at it. These are all pretty deflated, so that's why I feel good cutting. As you can see, we already had one pip, so really not that bad at all, guys. So, again, this is eight eggs from our yellow belly entry double head clown pied to let's a clown go. pie. All right? Day 56. Let's see what we get. We'll cut this one. Like I said, guys, this one right here, I already saw it. It wasn't a clown. It uh, doesn't look to be a pied either. It looks to be just like a copy of the mod. Yeah, I would say entry, yellow belly, double head, Kev. Yep. All right, so, so far, not proven out. Double. Double fisting? Videoing video in and taking pictures. All right, where do you want to go next, Kev? Top right. Here? Yep. All right. Let's see. I'm hoping she proves out, man. If not, mm. that's what happens, though, right? Because then it could be four years wasted. Yeah. That, that's what Send the shed to Charlie. Yes, listen, I, I, it, it, sometimes you get crushed with the odds. But with a double visual male, we should get both, if not some clown pies. I think two should be clown pies at eight eggs, right? That's yeah. the odds. I think two. I think so. Yeah. Um... We'll see what happens, all right, guys? Mm -hmm. uh, obviously, it'll be a big bummer because it's been four years of sitting and feeding that girl, right? Which is why, guys, you always got to make sure you pick up from a breeder you trust, right? Because I have been sitting on this human for four years, and having finally bred her in a clown pie project, you like to think you're going to get clown pies out of it. All right. That is not a clown pie. That is not a pie. That is not a clown either. 
That looks, nice. That looks like just like an M sheet. Yep. <laughs> Not doing good. Not doing good. So by the odds, guys, right, guys? 50% should be pie, 50% should be clown, and then I think a uh, fourth, right? Kevin? One fourth. One fourth should, should be, be I both. think I, I'm sure if we're wrong, we'll get blasted in the comments. Yeah, that's all right. We'll see. What do we got here? What do you want to do next, Kev? That bottom corner. Bottom right? Bottom left? Bottom left. I'm hoping. It would be nice, wouldn't it? It would be nice. Nice. And she, it actually, if we produce clown pies here, it would be the first clown pies we can produce. That would be pastel. I think all our clown all pies have been pastel so far, right? One of our females was a killer, and the other one was pastel. And our male, of course, has pastel. <laughs> that was like a normal. <laughs> yeah, dude, I think we got fucked. Let's <laughs> see. <laughs> well, if the odds gods are right, then those three should, we should get three that aren't visual. Anyway, Hopefully right? those are the three. All right, we want, we'll do this one, right, Kevin? Yep. <laughs> I think we're going to have an interesting conversation with our friend. <laughs> right. I'm getting a little pissed right now. Oh, yeah. If you notice Baker's color changing on his face. Oh, clown. All right. Oh. All right, we got a clown. Okay. Was it Yellow and she clown? Okay. All right. All right. All right, so she's had clown. All right, we got three more eggs. So we should get, I mean, realistically, we should get a pie to ready. I'm thinking she's probably just going to be a uh, head clown pasta and pie. We'll see though. We got a clown. We got one clown. What's right. like uh, yellow boy and she. He got that right. Clown. No, no clown. No nothing here. Which, which is crazy too, because if you think about it, even if because she obviously is head clown now, right? So half these babies should be head clown. Yeah. Should have got four clowns. So I'd, already you're getting screwed by the eyes. Yeah. But I don't see any pies either, right, guys? So what does that tell you? Not good. Not good at all. <laughs> I mean, listen. <laughs> That's going to be pied. Well, if it is a pie, it should be interesting, right? I mean, I don't know if it's going to be pied. No, it's not pied. So, listen. This is like a normal. Maybe yellow dog. That was like entry. All right, so this is where we're at, guys. So, long story short, I showed you who the breeder was. I mean, see, here's the thing, right? We, we Obviously, things do happen when it comes to the odds, gods. I will get it tested anyway. Uh, it is Het Clown. Obviously, she's a yellow belly entry, Het Clown. Here's your only clown of the group right here, which looks to be yellow belly entry. Uh, still a good-looking animal. No pies, only one clown. So here's the thing, guys. Everything, we should have got at least four clowns. Because she is Het Clown. We know that for a fact now. Should have got at least four clowns, okay? Um, if she has had pie, we should have had one pie. Chances are she's not pied, okay? Obviously, we kind of got fucked here. Um, the old pos pied. I mean, yeah, everything, I mean, this is going to be a yellow boy and she had pie, and everything else will be double head. Um, I mean, I don't see anything like a low pie. I mean, keep in mind, too, though, it is entry. So some could of these animals that low. look entry could be super low white. But most of the time when you see an entry pie, you can tell it's an entry pie. It's a different look to it than just entry. Um, but, yeah, guys, so far, not good, right? Not good. Oh, it's kind of pissing me the fuck off. Because here's the thing about bringing ball pythons, guys. <clears throat> Especially when I understand some people are flippers, which this guy is, okay? Um, that's what he does. He flips animals. And I have heard horror stories from one of our close friends. I'm not going to mention names. That's his business, his story. But he was sold het monsoons, I believe, or het sunsets. I think it was het sunsets. That were not het sunsets. So essentially, our buddy paid 10 grand to this individual for normals. Um, looks like I kind of got duped too. I'm not going to say, I'm not going to go nuts over it, right? Obviously, I'm a little pissed off. I'm not going to fucking go crazy over it because you don't know, right? Because she is obviously a clown. We only got one out of eight when four should have been actually visual clowns. All right, I will get her tested by Charlie. Um, Chettesting.com, great, great rider reptiles. I actually have a bunch to, to send out. She's in chest, and I got to wait even longer because I have a bunch to send out anyway. Uh, but that, that's the nature of the beast, guys, right? I've been sitting on this female for nearly four fucking years. <coughs> In my clown pie project, and now now it looks like she's just a yellow boy and she had clown. All right. Um, again, odds gods play a role sometimes. I could have got fucked. It happens. It definitely happened. She could be a, uh, a, a, head, a head pie, and I just didn't hit any odds. But I mean, yeah, one out of eight clown visual clown. Right, right. So we'll, you know, so we'll see. I'm not gonna go crazy. I'm not gonna reach out. But again, I'm very transparent on this channel. I showed you what we got. Right. I showed you the ad. Just to show you the lineage of my female and of which eggs I was cutting. Um, so we've been sitting this girl for four years, nearly four years, and if indeed she is not double head, it just shows you. Always buy from reputable breeders. 
Always buy from people you trust because you can sit on a project. You can sit there and raise a female up and skip a season, skip two seasons. And at the end of the day, I've essentially been sitting on a yellow Angie head clown for four years. Not the best thing to do, right? I mean, and now, again, I'm going to get her tested. I understand that. She could be actually head pot and we got smoked with the odds, but chances are it's not the way it's going to work. All right, guys? Uh, not the best thing in the world. Kind of is what it is, guys. That being said, back to our clown pie stuff. I kind of want to show off this clutch. Um, they're all shut out. And I put them away. You guys remember I actually bred my um, my whole back male that we now believe is... Oh, shit. This guy right here, which we now believe... Mm-hmm. Sick. Which we now believe is a pastel, orange green fire, possible leopard, uh pie pet clown, okay? That's the male we've been using. We actually bred him to a normal clown. I guys, like, I don't know if I, I think I talked about the clown. I got cut it on Patreon, right? Yeah. So we, they're all shut out. We separated them. So we'll show off a few of them, guys. Um, obviously, what we're looking for in that male was uh, orange dream, yellow belly, fire, and leopard, okay? So these are the animals we hit. All right, I'll tell you right now, he's without a doubt pastel. We kind of knew that already, though, right? But he's definitely fire also. Take a look. This animal right here looks to be uh, firefly to me, right, guys? Yeah. Maybe leopard. What do you guys think? This is you think it's a firefly leopard? All right, this is a female double head, right? I believe it's pastel fire. Then you go over here, guys. We got some, uh, what I believe to be OD, OD fires. All right, right here. Oh. Take a look. Really nice looking animals. All right, this looks to be OD fire. I think this might just be OD or OD fire also. And then, of course, we hit the one visual. Another clutch we got skunked with the odds for. Only one visual clown. It, and again, that male was bred to a normal clown. This, to me, this is a female, actually, guys. Orange Dream Fire Clown Het Pied Female. She'll be available. All these animals will be available. These are all females, actually. Um, but yeah, so we kind of proved out what's in that male there, right? That's something I wanted to do. Just to be a little unsure. Obviously, the one thing we're missing is uh, Yellow Belly, even though he has a lot of pixelation there. This is the only female that I thought maybe possibly could be Yellow Belly. But I think she actually, see, we're all right here. You guys, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think she might just be a firefly, possible leopard also. So I think as of now, we can label that male as a pastel, orange dream, fire, pie, head clown, possible leopard, not entirely sure with uh, the yellow belly. So what we're actually going to do is, I'm actually going to test it for yellow belly. Charlie, shedtesting.com. All right, guys? So that's the nature of the beast, guys. It looks like we got kind of fucked here. Um... I don't see any pides, Kev, right? Okay. Nothing indicative. That's a crazy pattern. Right? Yeah, it looks cool. Right? You know, that looks to be, I would say that's a yellow belly entry, right? Yellow belly entry clown. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So that's the, name of, that's the name of the game, guys. Buy from reputable breeders. Now, again, I'm not going to sit here and bad mouth Carlson yet. All right? So we're going to get her tested. Could have got her tested a long time ago. But because we had egg, eggs in the incubator, I figured, fuck it. Let's have some fun with it, okay? Um, that's where we're at, guys. Now, again, I'm going to say it again. I reiterated several times in this video. If you're buying hets, buy from a reputable breeder. Because you could sit on a yellow belly, actually double head clown pie, and she could not be clown pie. Okay? Um, not the end of the world, but definitely a kick in the dick. Uh, okay, guys. That's it. All right, guys. I'll keep you guys updated with that. Uh, our season's raging on, as you guys saw last video. Kevin and I got the shed clutch in there. Um, yeah, guys, not bad at all. Not bad. Kevin, anything? That's it. All right, guys. Be safe. Watch this thing.